Oh, look. It's that cool tent mode looking laptop Tim has. It's not a laptop, folks. That is a ZTE Exxon M. That's a 5.2 inch smartphone that we are now going to be using as our video rendering device. Hopefully everyone can hear me. I'm talking extra loud for the twits who always comment. I could hardly hear you, although I was on a crowded bus. Uh-huh. So, all that being said, let's get right over to the intro. And I've redone the intro and outro videos that I'll tack on so the volume is a little more reasonable and we'll work from there and we'll talk about power director on this phone and how much faster it is to render than using a PC. So let's do that right now. Intro time. All right, we're back. And we're going to fire up Power Director, which is right there. Let's go ahead and do that. Power Director. Optimizing app. Now I'm running Android 7.1 on here. 7.1.2, I think. And uh, we're going to uh, show you a little bit about Power Director. Huh. Hang on, you hit edit project. And look at that. There's your whole timeline there, folks. And if you wanted to insert something, you could at any point. And it's pretty easy to skip through it. And there's our outro. And of course, the outro and the intro are videos. And I just haven't done videos of the description below thing and you know that oh see we slipped right through it and uh I'm not sure who just got a notification me or Bethel doesn't matter. We'll deal with it. But the bottom line is, it's a great program. It took me six minutes to render an over seven minute video this morning. That is pretty crispy fast. I mean, whoa. It's one of those where you're like, holy crap, all oh, that. That's fast, yeah. So, if you're looking to render your videos on YouTube, and you have an older PC like I do, and just want to speed up the whole world, guess what? Qualcomm 821 for only, I don't know, under 150 bucks, it'll be linked in the description below, as usual. And uh, we're shooting this all in the Mi A2, so we should have no volume issues whatsoever. For them, it says, oh, I had to crank it up, I could barely hear you. It's like, well, 
Maybe clean the wax out of your ears and quit using earbuds at full volume. I don't know what you're doing. I watched it. That previous video on the PC. Using just the Spectre monitor speakers which face away. And I could hear clear as a bell. So I'm thinking, hmm. Maybe it's where you were listening it, to it or watching it. Uh, but Power Director works really, really good. I should have set the screen time out to be a lot longer on this. But it's okay. Got the super fast fingerprint reader on the side. So I'll be editing or rendering. There's not much to edit. Uh, it'll be that personal segment, this segment, and the outro. And that's all there will be. So if you like the video, if you found this informative in the least, as far as, you know, other ways to produce your videos to send out onto YouTube. This is possibly your way out. Use a phone with a, I'm guessing the phone we're using right here. One of the point nap, the Mi A2 with a Snapdragon uh, 660 could probably be on par with the 821 on here as far as doing that <coughs> the downside being hmm, well I'm not sure I need to install any more apps on the Mi A2 because I got like 247 apps at last count it's a bit high, so let's just say that we're pretty much done. I think the Axon M said, I'm tired of waiting for you to do something. So we're leaving it at that. And just consider for a fact that a 5.5 inch little screen phone rendered the very video you're watching now in a few minutes. And if that doesn't thrill you, well, that's okay. But make sure you either give us a thumbs up, thumbs down, oh, good snack now. And uh, consider subscribing and clicking the little bell next to where it says subscribe. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you tomorrow with. Another video rendered on this guy here from now on.